I am so mad because I was camped by Baha Ulawa Matachari. Let me just go straight to the point. This is what happened. Baha out of the blues start following me. Na unajua because mtu akiwa na blue tick, I think ina letanga, ina hua, ina pop as a priority kwa notifications. After like a minute, tena nikaona my likes on I was going to wash off my makeup, but I remembered I need to rant looking cute. I'm here to call out someone. And before I even call out that someone, what I need to say, I'm going to call me a jinga, I'm going to call me a fool. After I give you this story, you are allowed to call me a fool because I'm that fool who never learns. I am that fool when you do me any funza and I still never learn. So you know that nyanga mimi ni mother Jesus. I'm supposed to be solving everybody's problems. Anybody will just pop out from there and niambia kitu mimi na mahuruma zangu zenye hata I hate it right now that nakonga na mahuruma. I hate it that tinakonga na ile roho ya kusikia kai na jeka situation kwa na jeka niko na ile empathy ya like naanza ku feel like huyo mtu amekuja na hii story ananiambia hivi so na jeka kwa hiyo situation na, na imagine venye anaweza kuwa na feel and i it gives me the need to help i hate it right now i hate it because i was camped by i am so mad because i was camped by baha ula wa matachari let me just go straight to the point this is what happened baha out of the blues start following me na unajua because mtu akiwa na blue tick i think ina letanga ina hua ina pop as a priority kwa notifications after like a minute tena nikaona my likes on all my photos zimefuatana nishangaa huyu mtoto ni nini anani stalk kukaka nikaona dm ime pop up yake baha says hi and i'm like hi what's up and then he replies with a oh i'm good how are you nikamwambia i'm good myself uh, nikamwambia yeah i'm good and then what followed is at i know this is out of the blues but i'm coming to you as a small bro you know i'm an orphan and i don't know i, I don't have anyone to turn to i am so he goes on and on kuniambia like a, you know ali present like a very sad story when you're like he's an orphan and when you're kona mtu imdogo and he's being evicted and he just need like 450 dollars and then kuna brands and yes jamlipa na yondo pesa liko na tegemea ndio as a you know ku meet needs zake so mimi kwanza nikaona hivyo nika imagine of course being a content creator of course mimi nakuanga kwa bahati mzuri like on the lucky side because i don't have to depend on money yenye natoka kwa brands because i have like a job job but I'm, i can imagine if you're a full time content creator and then brand ime ku delayisha ama saa zingine venye wanalipanga half and then wanalipa half later and then ukwe probably kwanza ukwe si mtu hujipanga na ile pesa unapatanga as it comes So now na unaweza jipata kwa hiyo situation. So alafu venye amekuja na hii card ya like ama no fan and niko na mtoto and we are being evicted. Immediately tu nikaanza kukuwa na mauruma and then I have watched this boy from Matachari and yeah I remember is an orphan. Vitana na mimi from ile history nimekuwa nayo like currently I have like 330,000 Kenya shillings. 330 330k Kenya shillings yenye nina back and forth na watu wenye nimewakopea na wamekataa kurudisha i even have a family member mwenye nilimkopeshea pesa and she's just there like oh judia na shina akinifuatilia na pesa kwa sababu ya 20000 na kwa maju sasa 20000 ikitoka kushinda akinifuatilia can you imagine i help people with the money and then they talk badly they feel entitled to my money and people don't even understand how this america unajinyimanga time unajinyimanga maisha ukifanya overtime ndio make that like 70 dollars per hour na hiyo ndio wanasemanga lakini tumie tu ka 100 dollars as if it's just a ka 100 dollars people think una tokanga tu nje hivi unakamua pesa tu from nowhere just to send to people hey wacha nikwambie i am a good person i am a nice person and let me tell you i'm a very kind hearted person i'm a good person i'm a nice person and i know that deep down in out but until you cross my line that's when you see the devil in me by then akwa kama muguruki mimi naweza guruka so anyway back to the story so this guy tells me anataka for 50 and then kwa sababu hiyo bad history nimekuwa naye like nakopea watu pesa na wanakosa kurudisha na alikuwa anataka nimkopeshe hako anataka nimpe so si akanionyesha mpaka screenshot au kuna brand yenye amewakia but hawajamlipa but watamlipa in like i think three weeks time blah 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 whatever so mimi nikamwambia sawa as much as you have this evidence that this money is gonna be coming in 
Hii pesa saa zingine hata wao wenyewe nimekopeshea wanakuanga meniambia salari yao inaingia in like a week. Salari ikiingia ngo na patanga. Sipatangi. So nikamwambia nimekuwa na bad history ya kukopeshana huko pesa in Kenya and people don't return. So I came up uh, nikamwambia mimi saa hizi nimekuwa na money boundaries in the so, I made it clear to Baha nikamwambia ni Baha huyu wa machachari. I made it clear nikamwambia because of hii venye nimekuanga na issues nimekuwa na money boundaries in that I will only depending na venye mtu amenikujia na situation gani I will only lend money that I'm ready to lose like in case wo mtu akosend kunirudishia hasta sikia vibaya like I was ready to lose the money if you refund the money well and good if you don't it's okay wewe umejaribia hautaezi eza kuni access tena for my help you know that kind of a thing but I can only kopesha mtu ile pesa yenye na feel like I'm ready to lose. So like mtu akinikujia niambie oh mtoto wangu ameadmitiwa maybe anitumia hata like a, 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 an evidence. If I'm in that position at that particular time, if you asking me maybe ni kulendishie kitu kama 20,000 but I'm not ready to lose 20,000. I'll give probably 5k. Nisikie at least I have helped where I can. You know, hiyo tu like I want to be able to if I'm not in a position to help cause tena si kila mtu mimi nasaidia ngai na depending na pia si kila time nitakuwa naweza kusaidia cause I'm not a mother, I'm, I'm not I can't be able to help everybody and I can't be able to help every time every time wewe nikujei na msaidia every time ni ule ni ule eh ah, ah, I can't I also have my life I have my family I have like a whole list of people who depend on me you know that kind of a thing but anyway anyway to cut the story short nikamwambia mimi samkopeshia 450 but ndamkopeshia 100 kwa sababu that's the money i'm ready to lose in case hata nirudishia sitaskia vibaya sana like it's of course it's going to hurt cuz 100 is a lot cuz that's a whole one hour overtime yenye nimeka nikajitolea nikaka sacrifice sleep nikae nifanye job you know but then again it's better off like mtu akipotea na like a hundred dollars yangu kuliko 450 so mimi nikamwambia i'll send you a hundred dollars cuz that's what i'm comfortable with I'm not able to kukopea for 50. I can ni beg, can ya basi ongezea tu hata basi kwa 150. Ah, whatever. I was already tired with the back and forth. Already sasa hata zile huruma nilikuwa nazo juu alikuwa na ni bombard na ma messages na ma messages hivi hata before ni somi yashani. Alafu kila time ana insist ya manofan I don't have anyone to turn to. And because I'm an orphan and I know how it feels like sometimes not to have anyone to turn to emotionally and financially. Na if it but then naanza kusikia nika na ana misuse cuz mimi mwenyewe sto mimi. Kama mimi sta mkopeshia for 50 but nda mkopeshia 100 kwa sababu that's the money I'm ready to lose in case hata nirudishia staske vibaya sana like it's of course it's going to hurt cuz 100 is a lot cuz that's a whole one hour overtime yenye nimeka nikajitolea nikaka sacrifice sleep nikae nifanye job you know but then again it's better off like mtu akipotea na like a hundred dollars yangu kuliko 450 so mimi nikamwambia i'll send you a hundred dollars cuz that's what i'm comfortable with i'm not able to kukopea for 50 i can't beg can you basi ongezea tu hata basi kwa 150 ah whatever i was already tired with the back and forth already sasa hata zile huruma nilikuwa nazo juu alikuwa na ni bombard na ma messages na ma messages hivi hata before ni somi yashani alafu kila time ana insist ya manofan i don't have anyone to turn to and because i'm an orphan and i know how it feels like sometimes not to have anyone to turn to emotionally and financially na i feel but then naanza kusikia ni kana ana misuse cuz mimi mwenyewe sto mimi naanza ku feel like ana misuse na na abuse kitu ya like i'm an orphan cuz i mean i'm an orphan too but I have been in bad situations I have been broke but I, I don't try to get money from people by telling them oh you know I don't have my mom I don't have my dad I don't have you know I don't have to use that like if I'm broke I don't have to go through that sympathy whole situation thing I feel like it's wrong as much as is the truth like it it feels bad not to have someone to turn to financially like your parents or whatever but it's wrong to keep using that card anyway so kila time ana ni bobande na hiyo so akaniambia ni muongeze Uh, from 100 to 150 basi mimi nikamuongezea na nikamtumia na nikamtumia screenshot kamwambia ndio hiyo nimekutumia kijana wenyewe achaendelea kutuma messages wataendelea kupiga call ananiambia akisiz akisiz please i have tried to look for the rest of the money kuingine na nimekosa my friends ni, eh, wenye nilikuanga nao ni watu wabaya hata hawezi nisaidia tulikuwa tunasaidiana tu ile time niko na dosa hiyo ameni oh mimi nikamuuliza like kwani hauna like kabisa kabisa watu wenye mwingine unaweza kopa nikamwambia basi si wambie wife hata basi akope mabishti wake or something like yeye akusaidie tu kutafuta kaanza kuniambia oh 
hajo mimi sitaki kusumbua wife or sijui hata pia wife size ya kodao na atakuwa kipata gigs and aki tunafukuzwa ati hata sijalala for like 48 hours i've been so stressed up because i can't imagine being evicted with a small baby so una imagine like ananifanya by then askia vibaya akaanza kuni bombard na text by the i swear mtaziona cuz i'm going to attach receipts but just squeeze any receipts you just don't look like una ropo kwa vitu hapa anani bombard anaanza kunipigia ananipigia continuously anani tumia ma audios akini beg mimi namwambia enye nimekutumia ndio ninaweza please appreciate that and uone paluta cause kwanza out of the blues what makes you feel like sami peke yangu ndio naweza kusaidia hizo times zingine zote kwanza hata unjaku kini follow you just started following me so that you can ask for money and then unataka ikae mimi tu ndio naweza kusaidia then he kept sending audios and texts to make me feel guilty for not helping him kind of na hiyo ndio ilianza saa kufika point kaanza kusikia ai huyu mtu hata kweli by the way na ikaweza kuwa ni account yake imehakiwa but hii sauti ni yake kila kitu ni yake kwani hao watu wamehaka mpaka sauti yake but the way this person is behaving he's now behaving like a scammer or a spammer he's not behaving normal because a normal person is just appreciate guy huyu mtu at least amesema anaweza nisaidia na 150 wacha na mimi nione kwenye but yeye alikuwa na kama mpaka hiyo 150 nimetuma hai appreciate haioni kani kitu anaendelea tu kuni bombard na text za kunifanya nisikie guilty kila time anatoa hii kadi yake like i have a baby i'm a nofan i don't have sina mtu akunisaidia na shanga hii maisha yake yote hata kwa hiyo kuna nas judi out of the blues you hata kwenye alijua jina nas judi maybe li pop up to from somewhere algorithm akaanza kuni follow aka like my post zangu alafu sasa ndio ana slide dm ananiomba pesa alafu sasa ananifanya ni feel guilty Hey, you know what guys I did? Sai lifika point kasikia huyu ana behave like a spammer or a scammer. Nikasema, wacha niende kwa page ya wife yake, nione maybe wife yake anaweza kwa me update like something has happened to his account. As much as kabisa huyu chalia alikuwa many call nikasikia ni sauti yake ametuma audio nikasikia ni sauti yake. But nikasema with this technology you can hijack hata sauti ya mtu. So let me go to the wife's page nionekana za kuwa me mention something like you know my husband's account has been hacked or something like that. Kwenda huko mimi nikapata dem is just living her best life and i'm like i eh who you dem at our kaika watu wanapitia mashida cuz me the last time i remember we were like broke and going through shit you don't live your best life you know like that so me nikaenda kwa page ya wife yake Georgina nikapata eh who dem yeye anakatwa kwa ma happy anaka mengara vizuri yako tu like they were somewhere having like in a high end restaurant or something like that nikasema our eyes go and are evicted and this that's how it's looking like on the evil and leona evil ikabidi ni text georgina nikamuliza georgina are you guys oh nika kwanza nikasema hey i'm sorry to intrude but are you guys being evicted because your husband reached out to me akitaka nimkope pesa cuz anasema you guys are being evicted but from the look of things and from your insta stories i don't feel like that could be the case so kindly please niambie kama bahana and scam or actually you guys are being evicted and need help he wife akaniambia she's not even aware ya jeski ya kitu kama hiyo ye mwenye ndiye analipaga bills na amesort kila kitu everything is okay na hii pesa yenye bahana omba ni yake ya betting na amekuwa na hiyo shida na amekuwa kiombaomba watu pesa ndio abet lakini nyumba imelipwa kila kitu iko covered na iko covered na Georgina so that's what she told me akaniambia if she asked you for money it was not money to help us as the family it was money to help himself na ni ya kubet guy ya mungu wa live live ushawai jam ushawai jam jamaa alinitoa from my hundred ya kumhurumia ile yenye nilikuwa sikia woye yake woye this guy i watched on machachari you know alinitoa from hizo mawoye to zero na kwambia huo jamaa nilienda kwa dm yake guy alishangaa kama it's the same person he he was dealing with a few hours ago alishangaa ndio nakwambia i can be very good i can be very kind but cross my line and see the nasty side of me the ugly side of me aki my family can tell you mimi nikijam mimi nikabaya by the way mimi nikijam i'm the worst person ever and i know that i am very good until mtu ani atan like na by the way that's something i'm trying to work on cuz mpaka job i am very good i'm a good employee but try to cross me na kwanza ni mean on the right i'll show my true colors and from that let me tell you
hata mtu akuje kiniambia sijui nani anakufa hata sijui nani analala nja akilaleni nja mi mwenyewe i've been broke but i don't go begging kwanza people on social media out of nowhere i've been broke nimezungusha diaper nijitengenezea 100 bob yangu ndio nisi beg mtu yoyote so please learn how to work endo zungushe maka endo zungushe mandazi endo zungushe whatever mi nimezungusha diaper by the zile efforts na kwanga nimeweka ndio tu nisijipate nina beg mtu ai ekeni bidi mi uh, sitakuwa na kuja sijui mtu analetea shida na nakuja na mahuruma saa hizi huruma yenye nimebakisha najua ni estate peke yake but huruma ya hapa akia nani and i know i'm saying this like for the 20th time hii ni kitu yenye nimesema like and i, I feel like a fool na mpaka nilimwambia yeye i know i might regret this i might end up feeling like a fool and here i am feeling like a one I never learn. Yeah, kazi. Kwanza kitu ya kujua tisijui wewe kwa sababu mnatona tuko America mnadhani angatusi tu tunatoboka tu mapesa huku. We work for that money. We I might have the money but hey, you have no idea like what I I, I like what, like I sometimes I even have to do overtime because I'm not working ndio nipate pesa ya kuanza kupatia na right left and center. It's because nimepata hiyo opportunity eventually ya kukuja America where I always wanted to come and make good money ndio nifanye investment I make a good life so that I don't ever have to suffer or go back to that kind of life I've lived before or because I don't want my kids to ever go through even half of what I've been through so I'm here to make money so that I can give myself me myself and I a good life and my kids and probably what two extra ni how close my siblings my spouse and grace and maybe my in-laws but kila mtu mwingine